Hello, uh, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 44 of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play. We're doing the most in depth playthrough of this game on YouTube. In the last episode, um, oh yeah, we went through the Heine Desert. Uh, we managed to pick up the Psychium Z, and then we came here. Oh, well, we got our team Skull, and then we came here and talked to Grimsley to pick up Sharpedo. If you do want to check out that last episode, make sure you click the i card up at the top of the screen. In today's episode, we're going to continue on to Poe Town. We'll see how far we can get. So if you're excited for today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new. Both of those things help us out so much in becoming the next big thing. Let's go ahead and start off with a quick team recap. If I adjust the cables in front of me. Uh, but first up, we have Frisco, the Oricorio, Arukenimon, the Araquanid, Negative Vibes, the Snorlax, Jet, the Umbreon, whoa, Brock, the Alolan Graveler, and Buttons, the Decidueye. Now, at the end of the last episode, I had mentioned that I was going to go through, I was going to go back through, um, what was it? Rotom, shut up. I need to see the map. Okay. So I had said that I was going to go back through, and uh, there was like 2143 or something like that. I couldn't figure anything out for what it was, and honestly, I was just running into shiny, or shiny, running into encounters every other step, even though I had a rappel up. So I just gave up. So I'll look more into it and see if there's actually anything there, uh, and then we'll decide if we want to actually give it an attempt or not. Now this would be good training for uh, our buttons. We need another crit or that's it's gonna hit five times. What do you think? I bet it does. This feels like wasting our time and it's not gonna crit. I called that. I called that one. Uh, I don't know. Leading with Araquanid in the water probably isn't the smartest idea. I'll probably go ahead and switch Decidueye up. We'll just get him some extra levels. What's our? I don't even know what our next trial is. Like, I don't know who. I don't have a clue. Luminion. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Okay, let's go out here and we are going to use some Razor Leafage. Let's see if we can kill some. Zidjuai is cool. The way he stands, though, kind of over the way he stands, just because it's his way in Pokemon or in uh, Pokemon, and he doesn't move. What is up with this trainer? Both of her Pokemon set up an Aqua Ray. Also, why is it nighttime? I imagine over the next few episodes, this night time is going to change to kind of like it did over the last six episodes, I bet. All right, let's go ahead and move. Yeah, all of our Pokemon are under leveled, which I'm okay with being over leveled since we did the whole. I'm okay with being under leveled since we did refresh. I'm just trying to observe and see what all we have here. Is this a photo club? You know, everyone was really excited because we thought that these new... Uh, we thought these new pieces of land were going to be gems. And then they all turned out to be a Lola photo club. You know how much of a letdown that is? You know how much of a letdown that is? Yeah, yo, surfer bro. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, bro. Yeah, no matter how good you are at surf, you can't ride the waves like Stormy Sea, bro. Don't fight the waves, you gotta ride with them, bro. Yeah, bro, I've gotta work on my voices more. If you didn't know, we are streaming Digimon. Uh, some Digimon Cyber Sleuth we are streaming over on uh, Twitch. You can find that link in the description if you're interested, but we're... We're practicing our voices. 
All right, I'm gonna predict that he's going to use Air Slash, and then he won't have Water Pulse. As if Water Pulse was not like his signature move in second gen. Okay, I predicted this. Now I'm gonna predict that he does not have Water Pulse. He has Surf. My team is still really weak to... What? Uh, flying? Because, like, our only electric type attack is... Our only electric type attack is on a rock type. A slow rock type of bat. This is going to take some extra time. Also, it doesn't help that we're under level. I like how the trainer was just like... Like, whatever, go do your thing, bruh. Yeah, bruh. Yeah, bruh. Go do your thing, bruh. Yeah, whatever, bruh. Alright. Can this be somewhere to heal real quick? Mid route, heal up my grappler. Can that be something? Can that be a thing? Why do you have a man time? Actually, that's... That... Actually, how come all the other surfers don't have man? The wave's just too big for anyone to ride, bruh. Yeah, stay off the, stay off the, stay off the waves, bruh. Don't fight the waves, bruh. All right, where am I at? Where are these provide? Do I have them? Okay, and now I'm gonna use. Let's put all these potions out of here. There's no reason for us to have potions this late in the game. Absolutely none. I just wasted a potion. Okay, so is this an Alolan Fo- It is not an Alolan Photo Club. Ooh! I have not find a, found a sticker in a minute and a half. Everybody ride the wave, the Surf Association. Yeah, bruh. Let's break in here, bruh. Yeah. Totally. You know about it, don't you? You must. The mythical over the Gyarados. There's a trick that this legendary surfer once did. Oh, but he loved but Oh, but he was loved by both the sea and the mantine themselves. There's no one left who knows how to do it anymore. Oh, so there's a combination that gives you something called There's like sun on fire sank down beneath the waves. Okay, I need to start practicing. I need to start practicing man time, sir. I say it as if I've had any time to do anything in my life over the last couple weeks since this game came out. Don't be fooled. I have not had any time in my life. Not any at all. So let's head down. I can actually see the map. It's so useful for once. Rotom, thank you for not getting in my way. So why did why did we take why did they take surf surfing out of the game? Let's think about fourth gen. I'm thinking about the map in fourth gen, and the only thing that I can think of that required surf was getting to Victory Road, right? So you go from whatever that eighth city is. I'm sure, I'm sure once I do, I'm sure once I visit Sinnoh in a future playthrough, I will learn better. Also, did I run into a wild tentacruel? Or am I seeing the future? I'm, I'm concerned. Did I run into a wild tentacruel or did I see the future? Hit it! You're actually gonna go for poison jab. Okay, so it just does the ghost, the ghost Z, uh, the ghost Z dance. Hit it! Let's go. 
Sinister Arrow Raid. Woo! Get him! Get him! Get him, Decidui! Get him! Uh! Uh, 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 uh! I didn't kill? That's concerning. Great Shackle! Priority? No. It wouldn't be priority. Shadow Sneak is priority. You can't have a priority 80 power move. That just hits. Like, I get that Sucker Punch is probably a little stronger than that, maybe? I get that, like... But you can't just have, like, a... Where are you going? I guess I'm going over there. What the fuck? But, like, what I was saying was, in 4th gen, like, you only had those couple... couple spots to, to surf. In 5th gen, I mean, it was very minimal surfing. In 6th gen, there was no surfing whatsoever, right? Um... Wait, 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 wait. Sixth gen, all you did was like go across a lake. Couples that work out together stay together. Thought I was gonna run in front of them. Thought I was gonna run in front of them. Alright, who are we leading with? Who are we leading with? We have Decidui and we have Frisco, that's fine. Alright, let's go. Abs! Abs! When I get in the ocean, I get pricked by Corsola or Pukumuku. We both have two completely different process. Like, mindsets. <laughs> Look at that guy. Look at him flexing. Flex on them. Uh, frillish and frillish. Oh, I've got bad news for you. That's cute. Don't get me wrong. That's cute. That's cute and all. But I, I'm going to take it a little deeper. I'm going to go for this, and I'm going to go for this. You're dead, and you're not going to get to attack. You just heal your... Oh, you use Surf. Okay. Oh, I was like, I did not see... Oh, gosh. Ominous Wind? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold the phone. What the heck happened here? What the heck happened here? My phone is just great. It is just going off. Actually, it's my iPad sitting right next to me. Okay. That's a broken strategy. If we're being honest, you're just gonna sit there and use Surf and Heal? That's so... Who at the Pokemon Company okayed this? They just switched roles. Can we acknowledge that? I just got smacked up for no reason. What the heck? One frillish down. What was that? That's wild. That's actually... Again, I've said it many times. I love that this game is more difficult. And it's even more difficult because... I'm not playing with, uh, or I'm not, I'm not leveled. Like, I'm under leveled right now. Wow. Okay, that actually did not do enough. Good job, Dartrix. Why do I keep calling you Dartrix? He was Dartrix for like 500 episodes. He's not Dartrix anymore, dang it. That's because Frillish is so adorable. It's just so adorable. Blaga, 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 blaga. I feel like that was all the trainers. I really don't like... I wish they would go back to doing what they were doing at some point. Also, our Pelago... I'm a little concerned about what's going on right there. I'll come back and... She was searching me out! 
Wait a second. Hold the phone. I just... I'm remembering stuff. Hold on. I've got to go back. There's a trainer I forgot to go back in battle, isn't there? On Route 12. The trainer told us to battle everyone on the route. And of course I did, but I didn't go back and battle him. Let's fly to Route 12. This is like... This is random. Okay, uh, is it you? It appears you have completed your training and defeated Route 12's other trainers. Then I, the Kahuna of Route 12, were honored with a battle. I'll show you the Z power. I'm not ready! I'm not ready! I made a mistake! Hold on, I'm sorry. That was actually super noobish of me. Um, Jet, you're gonna lead us. Let's do it! Alright. This is the devastating Z power of the great Kahuna of Route 12. Is he just like a self proclaimed Kahuna of Route 12? Or is he like actually. You have two Pokemon. Let me not judge. Thirty-five. Fight. I should have used payback. Oh, I should have used payback. That would have done so much damage. Hold on. Let's see if he goes for something different. Or if I dodge randomly. Okay. So, let's go out to... Yeah, this this makes sense. Let's actually... The one time this episode that I don't lead with our Okenimon is the one time that I should have led with Aru Kenimon. Go ahead, Bug Bite. Oh no, that did... Are we serious right now? Are we actually serious right now? Did that actually do half? Okay. Oh, we don't need Z-Move, we just need Bubble Bing. Gone! Get him out. Yeah, you're definitely gone. Okay, so again, is this guy just like the self-proclaimed Kahuna? What else you got back there? Pinsir. That's actually pretty frightening. But I have a Frisco. Uh, I guess Frisco is going to be super effective if it has like a bug move. I would imagine it has X-Scissor. <laughs> but will it live long enough to use X-Scissor? That's the question. Did you know that Pinsir is a 4% encounter? Ugh. Don't use quick attack. Okay. Did you know that Pinsir is a 4% encounter in Lush Jungle? I found it. it. Didn't even take that long. Yeah, this was the weakest of the Kahunas that we fought so far. Ugh, I've been done in. I yield to you the title of Route 12 Kahuna, and this as well. Dragon Tail. I've been looking for Dragon Claw. Close. Not allow myself to be satisfied with the title of Kahuna in such a small area like this. This time I start setting my goals on the wider world as well. I agree. Set your goals high. Aim high. Never give up. Always reach for the... Always. Always. If someone tells you you can't do it, freaking do it. And then rub it in their face. That's what I do. That's what I do. I love it when people tell me I can't do something. You'll never be the kahuna of anything else. Really? Well, thank you. Thank you for your input. I will remember that. And you will hear from me when I make it. I feel like... Wait, why? Hi, Rotom. I will acknowledge you. Let's Roto Lodo. Roto. Roto Lotto. Ooh, what's this? I'm scared. What is this? Roto Friendships. Okay. After the sixth time I get an item, do you really need to tell me what it is, Rotom? I think you're good. You could just sit there and shut up. Uh, 
All right, what do we got here, kid? Hey, um, you want to see? Want to see what I made? It's really cool. I made a sandcastle. Want to see? Yeah, sure. Show me. I'm gonna let you see it this one time. Hee <laughs> hee. Wait, kid. Um. Ah! Oh, it did sandy gast. Got it. A wild sandy gast? Is there any reason I should catch it? It's only level 30. I can't hit it. Let's go to Jet. Jet should be able to bite it and knock it down. And I guess we'll just try to catch it. Might as well. Mega Drain. Why is that a Mega Drain? I was so close to using a Sandy Ghast. I was think I had been thinking about it for a while. I'm so glad I didn't use a Sandy. Okay, well. I love Astonish's animation. It's so cool. Alright, I don't feel like I don't feel like playing around. I feel like progressing. Gotcha. That's right, Sandy Gast. Woo! Also, since we got our Pokemon full uh, refresh, I don't even feel like doing the whole uh, air thing anymore. What's this kid about to say? Ah, oh, Pooey! I thought I could get you to. S thought I, I thought I could make you. Whoa! I thought I could make you get sand for me too. Oh well, there's plenty of other prey here on the beach. What? Something is lying on the ground where little boy had been standing. Hey, hey! Come on out here, my Pokemon! Oh! She said, "I see you, Pokemon." Go! Alright. We have a sand tree. Who am I leading with? Am I leading with Aro Kennymon? Please tell me I'm leading with Aro. Actually, sand tree. I'm not gonna lie, I wouldn't be opposed to using an Alolan sand tree. That looks amazing! Ice Ball looks amazing in this game. That was freaking cool. That was freaking cool. That was freaking cool. Anyway. Anyway. What I was saying was... I wouldn't mind using... an Alolan Sandshrew at some point. I don't think I don't think this will be the playthrough for it. But I wouldn't mind using it at some point. This thing is pure fairy, right? So Brick Break's not gonna, like, help me here. But uh, I do think that we're hearing the end of Snorlax this time. I just don't know what's going to replace him, to be honest. I don't have a clue what's going to replace him. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, I do. I know exactly what will replace him. Okay, yeah. I n never mind. I know exactly what will replace him. I'm pretty sure I've even said it, like, a long time ago. Giga Impact. What's higher? My... Okay, so my special defense is way higher than my defense. So, I'm gonna get rid of Amnesia. Does that make any sense? Okay, here's my thinking. Using Defense Curl, I might need to use Defense Curl more than I would need to use Hunter. Um, I might need to use Defense Curl more than I need to use Amnesia. 
Maybe that doesn't make... I don't know. Maybe I just made a really big mistake. Well, I made a big mistake in switching Aru Kenimon. Or in, in. Because I don't know my type. But this will work. If, if I bite this turn, it should have a chance to flinch the next time. Because if you think about it, like, if this was actual battles, like, if you're thinking, like, if Pokemon were real, and it used its attack, and I used bite, and then it goes for its next attack, like, there still should be a chance to flinch there. Is that just me? I, I think that moves that have a chance to flinch should have a chance if you them a turn before. But what's happening here? Ah, I don't know what to do. What's wrong? This mysterious Pokemon, Starmie, it's my buddy, but I really loves staring contests. I'm scared, I can't win. It's been doing staring contests for a week. I want to go home, but it won't move an inch unless it loses. Oh, here we go. Let's go, slow poke. Let's go, slow poke. Slow poke, slow poke, slow poke, slow... Wait, he blinked. Enough of your crying, try it. Let's go home, shall we? Oh, seriously? You still want to do staring contests? Is there a Pokemon that can beat my Starmie? If there were a Pokemon that knew Tickle, would be able to beat my Starmie instantly. That's not... Episode 44! Uh, what route is this? The heck am I? Route 15. Pokemon with Tickle. I with Starmie. That's not weird. That's not weird. That's not weird at all. What are you talking about? That's not weird. Perfectly normal. All right, so we're gonna come up to the Pokemon Center. We're gonna heal one more time, and we are going to call it an episode. So in today's episode, we wound up doing some Sharpedo exploring. Getting our way through Route 15. Now here we are. Um, and things are about to kick up, okay? I think in the next episode, we're gonna make it to the entrance of Po Town. I doubt we're gonna make it inside of Po Town. I feel like my pacing isn't bad. I just feel like some of these trainers that we fight wind up taking us a long time. But anyway, if you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new. Those couple things, they take just a second and they go a really long way in helping us become the next big thing. We'll see you for the next episode of Pokemon Ultra Moon, the expanded Let's Play. Until then, have a blessed day.